What's going on, guys? Bruce Matson here, your host of the show, Metro Scout Fantasy Football. One guy I want to go over this week from their week one performance is Jahan Dotson. I'm going to pull up his touchdown catches. I'm going to give that a quick look. And overall, he had a good performance for his first game, a good flash of his talent. And honestly, Wentz was looking his way too. He even locked on to him on a play where it looked like he got intercepted. I think there's some good things coming his way. And if he's available on waivers and fantasy, go get him. He should be on a team. But you know how it is in some of these leagues, especially in redraft, shorter benches and stuff. A lot of things can happen, and there's a lot of people watching the show. Just give him a good look in your waiver wires. He should be rostered. He should have got picked up on Wednesday but you never know. But let's look here. He's at the top of your screen. We're going to go by this for frame by frame. That way, things are working per YouTube standards. But here's him coming off the line of scrimmage, coming straight up. He's not telling where he's going to go. Looking straight at the DB. DB's outside shade right now. I can barely tell from the screen. Not the best angle. Here we go. We're starting to drop them hips. So now he's giving him the DB the tell that I'm either going to go right I'm going to go left, or I might go straight past you, and you're just going to have to read me real quick. So here we go, shimmy shake. Instead of dead legging, faking to the right, he makes a quick move to cross his face, gets the separation. Look at that separation right there. You got feet there. If you're even, you're leaving, and he's way more than that. Ball's coming his way. Look at him rise up, make sure he's protected to make the catch. Sure does. Touchdown. Great play by Jahan Dotson. And now we're getting ready to run the next play. He's at the bottom of your screen here on ball. And we're going to lose him. Getting downfield. Wentz looks his way quick. You even, you leave him. That means if the wide receiver is up against that DB, running stride for stride almost, maybe a little ahead, maybe even a shade behind, that quarterback, if he sees that, he likes it, he's going to toss that up. Especially if you've been successful with it, whether in practice, in camp, or in games. Wentz sees that instantly. Let's it go. Ball's in the air. Good trajectory. Decent ball. Here we go. One-on-one -on -one situation. Look how tight we are right here in the end zone. Comes up. Look at that play. Look at where his hands are at. Look at where his body's at against the DB. Brings it in. And that's sexy. That is a sexy catch. Let's come back here and go slow with it. So the ball's coming in. He's just lunging forward. And that's a hard play to make. Look at that. Look where he's at. Look who's on him. In the end zone, two feet down, looking good. Brings it in. Jahan Dotson getting it done. And very good week one performance. Air yards wise, target share wise, not up there with some of the other receivers, but he was getting it done. He was getting looks. He was getting locked on to. And Jahan Dotson is a guy you need to think about. Just another one of those rookies. I think I had a video last week, if I remember. He could have been one of those wide receivers that surprised us. And he damn did last week. Jahan Dotson is a guy you want to think about. If anything, I might have been too low on him during the draft process. Him and Terry McLaurin could be a good duo. That could be a damn good duo. But let me know what you think about him in the comments. Drop that below. Make sure you smash that like button on the way out. Helps the video on the algorithm. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because I'm dropping content like this left and right along with other fantasy videos. Check out my running back rankings that I dropped last night. I dropped a top 40. Use those to help you set your lineups. I'll drop another set of running back rankings later this week, but those will be on the tier list. I'll try doing that as well to help you guys out when I'm making changes as I'm getting more information throughout the week. But I want to thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the next vid.